Hey Joe, how you doing? Okay, so two watches. First, this is the 7017 uh, Dany Chronograph, and it looks, as you can see, it's in pretty shiny condition. Looks pretty decent, all told. Um, and it's not running badly, as these will, even in unrestored condition, these Dany Chronographs, they do really well. Uh, it's going to be a lot better when we're done servicing it. I just serviced one of these 7017s for myself uh, last week. And they run in the 280s to 300s. They're just they're great, great, great movements. Great movements. Yours is a couple of issues. Nothing major. But uh, we're definitely things that we're going to have to look at. But yeah, they run so beautifully. Yeah, they run so great. Here's the one that... I just restored for myself last week. Isn't that cool? That's a little, a little worn, but that's a neat watch. I just think they're they're super cool. That one was a lot of fun to bring back. Okay, yours. Uh, it's it's functional. It's good. The only problem is is that someone set the. Um, so, yeah, there's nothing really to say about the movement. It's clean. These are faintly hairy to service. Uh, they've got a few things that are funky about the dia shock or about the dia fix settings. How these are done, a little bit funky, but they are um, not nearly as gnarly as like a, a 7018, 7016. Lots of fun, beautifully made chronographs. Danny really knocked it out of the park when they did these. You know, like all of this era of Danny's work. They did really well. Now here's the only problem. This hand is set incorrectly. That is the reset right there. So these hands, Danny did something different than Sua is that the hands are set, they're one-time set hands. I'm sorry, they're not one-time set hands. They're actually, they're preset to the specific chronograph wheel. So um, they should be able to swap across and they're already there. They should be automatically oriented correctly. This one's not. So somebody was feeling funky and they weren't correct about what they were doing. But the dial is beautiful. The loom is nice. Uh, and after service, I think you'll have just a fantastic watch. It'll be great. So uh, the, my only question mark is getting that new hand, that, that hand set again correctly. Your other watch. Your 7019. Brother, it is roasted. It is done. What is all this stuff anyway? What is all this? Is it what, what is it? It looks like pollen. It's the it's the the, the metal of the winding weight got water in it and just disintegrated. Yeah, the whole the whole weight fell apart. Look at that. Oh, well, well there's your problem. What the heck is going on here? Hang on a second. I want to blow this out really quick. gnarly so that was all dust your mainspring is completely seized okay i can't uh i can't power that up at all we've had not that i would really want to try i blew it out it looks a little better wow your balance looks okay i don't know what i'm gonna find in this one i don't know what i'm gonna find in this one yikes 7019s are good movements too. They've got dual the dual diafix. Really cool stuff in there. Um, this is a rare model watch. That's more of that pollen corrosion stuff from the winding weight. The loom doesn't look bad under here. The dial looks okay. The hand loom's a little degraded. But we've got some rust in there. See this on this hand right here? Water got in and it wicked its way through the entire movement. 
we might be looking at uh, replacing the entire movement. Thankfully, this is one of those weird instances, by the way, where Danny used a Sua crystal. This is the same crystal as goes in the 60, uh, 60105s, which we happen to have. Yeah, but anyway, we might be looking at relooming this handset. Oftentimes, this kind of surface corrosion is just sitting on top of the chrome, and a lot of times we can get that off of there. I don't know how it's going to look. It's a matter of how much you really, how much do you want to invest in this watch? You let me know. Um, I mean, I have 7019 movements that we could swap out. It's going to add significantly to the cost, but we can do it. It's a matter of if you really want to invest in that. You let me know. Great watch. Few turns and twists. This one could be good with some love. Uh, we'd have to see how that one comes back. Okay, please let me know, Joe, if you want to move ahead on these.